بسم اللہ الرحمن الرحیم السلام علیکم ڈیئر اسٹوڈنٹس ٹوڈے وی ہیو ٹاپک آف چیپٹر نمبر نائنٹین دس از دا سیکنڈ ٹاپک آف چیپٹر نمبر نائنٹین دیر از ڈی بروگلے ویوز اینڈ دا ہائیڈروجن ایٹم اوکے ڈی بروگلے پرزینٹڈ دس انٹرپریٹیشن آف بوہر میگنیٹان بیکاز بوہر واز فیل ٹو ایکسپلین دا کلاسیکل ریزرویشن آف ہائیڈروجن ایٹم کلاسیکل فزکس سی دیٹ when any system is accelerated it will gain energy or it will lose energy so if it is gain energy so the electron will move far away from the nucleus and if it is lose energy so the electron will come towards the nucleus and will fall on the nucleus so no such type of hydrogen no such type of structure of hydrogen atom is possible so de broglie have the answer of these resurrection and de broglie is, uh, defended the bohr atomic model in this way that whenever the electron uh, revolving around the hydrogen atom so this electron is behaving as a wave this electron is not behaving as a particle this electron is behaving as a wave so whenever this electron is moving around the nucleus so this electron is following in the form of waves and this electrons um, is making uh, is making a stationary waves and we know that the energy of the stationary waves is always constant so if we consider electron as a wave and it is making stationary waves around the nucleus so then we can say that the energy of electron in this orbit will be constant so de broglie interpret the bohr atomic model in this way that electron here is in the form of wave okay now consider the electron is move, moving along the wave form so we know that suppose this is the one cycle one cycle so we know that in the one cycle uh, l is equal to 2 pi r the circumference of the circle so there are how many cycles here so there are n cycle so l is equal to n 2 pi r this is the circumference of the cycle which is which uh, electron followed okay now look at here l is equal to n 2 pi r this is the circumference which in which electron is following okay now no uh, leave it this circumference first we are talk about the distance so l- let us consider uh, this is the one cycle uh, one cycle followed by the electron so we know that the distance in one cycle is lambda so i call this distance as lambda okay now putting the circumference here uh, how many lambda here the lambda here is n lambda so the total length will be equal to n lambda and we know that the length is equal to circumference so 2 pi r is equal to lambda so 2 pi r is the circumference is equal to n lambda so here uh, we know that the de broglie wavelength is equal to uh, lambda is equal to h by p and we know that we know that the value of p is uh, mv and here here the value of lambda putting the value of lambda here so lambda will be equal to 2 pi r divided by n okay so lambda will be equal to um, 2 pi r divided by n so it will be so it will be it will become uh, if we cross multiply this equation as so it will become mv r is equal to n h divided by 2 pi okay so this mv is momentum so it is rp and this is nh divided by 2 pi so rp is angular momentum so it is nh divided by 2 pi so this is the quantization of angular momentum which was uh, postulated which was formulated by the bohr atomic model so it means if we consider the electron is a wave then we can say that the angular momentum of electron is quantized so it means that uh, electron is behaving as a wave so it will neither gains energy nor lose energy so its energy will be constant and its angular momentum will always be quantized so de broglie supported the bohr atomic model in uh, if we consider the electron form the stationary waves if you have any queries any questions just comment on the video and uh, te- whatsapp your uh, questions in the group so take care love is